in with something else, because well, this is the thing, Oprah, before, in addition to what's Charlie Rose really like, right, right. people always ask, when is Oprah coming on, when is Oprah coming on, and today's So today. she's here. So let's start talking about OWN yeah. Network. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> when you set out to create a network, tell me what you wanted to do, and where does this thing called Life Class fit in? Well, let's say, when I set out to do it, uh, David Zaslov, uh, at Head Discovery. Of the Discovery Network. Yeah, Discovery Network had come to me holding a copy of O Magazine, Magazine saying he wanted to be able to create a channel that did exactly what the magazine did, what inspired people to live their best lives. And so that idea is something that had been stirring inside myself for a very long time. So the idea of creating a network was something that I'd wanted to do. Had I known that it was this difficult, uh, I might have done something else. Really? If, if you knew that it was going to be this difficult, you might have not done it. Oh, absolutely. But you what didn't think was, it was going to be easy. I didn't think... What, would you let me ask? Okay. okay. I you didn't, didn't think, think it was, was going to be exactly easy. exactly my point, too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I, I didn't think it was going to be easy, but I did not know... If I, if I knew then what I knew now, I might have made some different choices. I would say, uh, if I were writing a book about it, I could call the book 101 Mistakes. Mm. Give us a, maybe the top yeah. five. Uh, the top five was launching when we really weren't ready to launch. Mm. And doing that because you'd announced that you were going to do it. Mm. And it's like having the wedding when you know you're not ready and you're walking down the aisle yes. and you're saying, oh, I don't know if we should be walking down the aisle. Yeah. Maybe we should have postponed this. But the invitations are out. But the invitations are out there. there. Go the ahead. And so yeah. maybe, you know, when I think about it now, but now it's really Monday morning quarterbacking, okay. uh, I would have probably waited until I actually finished the Oprah show. Right. Because right. from the day that David Zaslav came in to see me, I said to him, you know, the thing that I'm most worried about is who's going to lead this train because I can't do it. I know how hard it is to do a daily show, yes. do we not? Yeah. And I'm, do, I'm in Chicago and that's in Los Angeles and that's going to be very hard. And uh, last year actually, I was sitting literally at the feet of Lorne Michaels. Yeah. And Lauren Michaels said to me, yeah. you have no idea yeah. what, you're what, getting what, into. what you've stepped yourself into. He also said, you're going to have a lot of schadenfreude. You're going to have moments where people, he said, nobody wants to see you come off the Oprah Winfrey show yeah. of all those 25 years of success and step right into the, 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 the network business. You've got to pay your dues. He said, they don't want you. They're going to, they do not want you to do well. And you will, you will he see does, that. He says, and you're going to have some failures yes. and you're going to have to use some expletives. Yes. Mm, you've yes. been using expletives? I had to use a couple. All right. You're going to have to use some, yeah. Here's what else.